Hey there, everybody and anybody. Welcome to The Binding of Isaac Afterbirth Plus. Now, this game has been out for ever. Uh, yeah, it's, it's been out for years and years. And in fact, I've had it for a long time. Um, however, um, I, I don't get to play it as much as I used to. So I figured, why not make a series on it? And then I'll get to play it. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and open up a brand spanking new uh, file save because I'm not I'm not like you know like huts or cobalt streak or whatever has all these things I'm not I, I'm not that good at least not yet uh, I hope you guys enjoy um, make sure if you do make sure remember like comment and subscribe to the channel so uh, we're gonna start off we'll just do a regular uh, I'm gonna do hard because I'm, I'm good enough at the game and it'll just unlock more stuff so do an Isaac run, um, and we'll just go ahead and, and work on killing, uh, uh killing, uh, dude, not even mom's heart or anything. We're not even at that point. Uh, so, um, if you have never seen Binding of Isaac, uh, again, why are you watching me if there's so many other good people out there? But, uh, basically, um, you are um, a boy whose whose mom get uh, is uh, is a is kind of a religious fanatic, and she starts hearing the voice of God. And he oh my God, what an awesome first item! Uh, I'll go over it in a little bit. And uh, basically, um, get out of here. Uh, got him. All right. So, uh, and, and then you, like, run off into the, uh, into the basement in order to, like, escape her. Um, the only reason I'm doing this is, one, uh, to get into the room because I can unlock, um, an item. And, um, oops, I already got room, that's right. Uh, and then two... To, um, just to see if there's anything good that I might need. I may start to, uh, if I get enough money, Something's wrong. start to add to um, my donation machine. Uh, I should have waited. That's fine. I don't think I'll take any damage. Uh, so... Item room in the first, uh, in, in the first, uh, there we go. Mm, no. Item room in the first, uh, area is, uh, is always free, so, uh, so I don't need any keys for it. Um, and I got little brim. Now, little brim, basically, if you hold down, uh, a, an area, and as soon as you let go, he'll shoot out a brimstone shot like that. Uh, he's... Probably my favorite um, familiar in the game. Succubus is pretty good though too. Um, oh, and my damage is now up. That's great. Uh, so yeah, I'm going to uh, go ahead and just put a bunch into my donation machine. Just for now. Hopefully I'll get another key, because I do want to get into the other, uh... I'm going to go into the item room, but I'm going to want to get into the, um... Shop as well. Now, if you didn't know the reason why I did that was because there are uh, item or uh, secret rooms. Uh, not always, but for the most part. And. 
And I thought maybe there would have been one there. And doing this, blowing up pots, will sometimes give you money, sometimes give you enemies. It was worth it. Uh, I'm not going to go into the item room yet. I'm going to go into... Um, uh, I'm going to go into the item room first. So I have to go find it. This is probably where the secret room is. Perfect. Double perfect. Okay. Trail of Tears basically is just gives me a uh step on. It's, it's it's fine. Um I'm gonna do this because possible there, no. It's fine. I I did want the uh I wanted the money so it was worth it. Which there is. And now I've gotten ten coins in there. Now, I will grab that. That is health. Uh, however, before I get that, I want to grab my multi-dimensional buddy. Because sometimes there's some good stuff in there that will cost uh, extra hearts. That only cost one. But sometimes they'll cost two. So I wanted to make sure to, uh, to be able to regain some health. So... I'm not going to explain any of the monsters or anything like that. Um, if you are curious about monsters or anything, um, there is uh, some good uh, sites uh, online. Um, it's called PlatinumGod.co.uk. I'm going to throw it up on the uh, screen here. This will give me, every time I pick up a coin, um, a key. Um, <clears throat> these blue hearts that I've been picking up, th th those are called soul hearts. Uh, the thing about soul hearts is that um, they, they're not a part of your, your heart counter. If you get hurt, um, and you, you lose a red heart, you can pick up another red heart like we saw in here, and it'll fill it back up. The soul hearts, once they're gone, they're they're basically just gone. Oh, that's nice. But the soul heart you can just pick up and, and they'll tack on to the end there. Perfect! I Now I got two bombs. This one will let me go across. 
This one will blow this one up. And I see the X on there. That's called the Tinted Rock. And those have soul hearts. And because I grabbed so many hearts here, I got um, Lazarus. It's a character to unlock. So, oh, you bastard. Binding of I oh, damn it. Binding of Isaac is known as a roguelike or rogue rogue light, depending on how you like to say it. I like roguelike, uh, because it's based off of a type of game from way, way back in the day. Punching bag is basically a familiar that follows you around and runs all over the room and other other monsters will attack it instead of you sometimes By taking pills, you're basically taking a chance that it could be a good stats up or a bad stats up. It could hurt you. It could be good for you. Uh, it's a lot of things that it could be. Go ahead and blow this guy up. For money. Sweet. Um, these blue chests here... Uh, basically our, our unlimited uh, openings. Well, not unlimited. That's a bad thing. But they'll close. They're angel chests. Oh, that became totally worth it. So we got Cricket's Head. Cricket's Head is just an uh, a overall damage up. If you see on the, the left side of my screen, um, you'll see all of Isaac's stats. You have uh, speed, you have range, you have tier rate, meaning how many tiers he shoots per uh, per second, basically, per minute. Uh, your shot speed and your damage. Uh, after that is your luck, and then you have your chance of getting an angel deal or a devil deal. I'm just taking the time now to clear the rest of this uh, level. Uh, there could be some other good stuff that uh, comes up, uh, and then uh, we'll go face the boss and keep going. Now this is like a mini boss, as you can see. She gave me some health here. Now, one cool trick that I have with, with Chubb here is you can drop a bomb, he'll eat it, he'll stop for a second, and it'll blow up inside of him. Okay, Pageant Boy. Now, what this does is it just gives me a bunch of... Well, I can purchase this. I don't actually want that one because I don't even have a, anything to use at the moment. Uh, that's really good. Go ahead and grab that. That's every time I get hurt, uh, I will get... Um, money for it. Don't want that. Come on. Ugh. Alright, I'll, I'll spend money and get a heart. But that's fine. Uh, I have enough health to spare here that I'm gonna go ahead and do this. And I got a black heart for it, which kind of sucks as I'm it. Now, black heart is just like a soul heart. Once it's gone, it's gone. Except when you t lose that black heart by taking damage, it'll pop up that little heart, and it will uh, basically uh, damage everything in the room. Which would have been great had I not get hurt doing that. No. Now, I could have hurt myself before taking the black heart and and, you know, basically I would have went bent down an entire heart um, to save it, but I'm not worried about things hitting me all that much, so. And my damage is very good right now, so. 
I took damage, and if you take uh, red health damage, you will uh, remove a, uh, a good significant portion of your chance of getting a devil deal. However, with how many soul hearts I have, that does not count, um, it, it really won't be a problem for me. It's a good spot for a... Uh, Good chance of a uh, secret room there. Oh, so we have a curse now. We're in an area that, that's cursed. It's called a curse of the unknown, which means I have no idea what that is. Okay, uh, until I pick it up. So it could be really bad. Now it's a continuum, which means no matter which direction I go because of my range, it'll shoot through uh, and it'll pass through things like rocks and everything. Uh, it's a it's a decent one. It's okay. There are ones that I like more. But it's not one that I can't stand. Ow. There we go. Took away my ability to do it. Anyway, oh, that's amazing. So this was greed. Sometimes in the in, in these rooms, and sometimes he's in um, uh, secret rooms. Uh, he's just somebody who will fight and give you a lot of money, or sometimes he'll give you a steam sale. I love steam steam sales. However, it, it, this one did take away one of my rooms here. Steam sale is basically fifty percent off anything you would purchase in the store. Uh, with the amount of money that I have, it's that's really good. Uh, however, I'm very close to being in the mom fight because this is a brand new one um I'm probably not gonna get much of a chance to use that steam sale which kind of sucks uh a little hint if you uh leave and then come back sometimes this one will pay out some, some goodies use that get some These skellies, I hate them the most. They are my absolute, absolute least favorite. However, with uh, my my tears that pass through and everything, it's not so bad. All right, next boss, the fallen. He breaks into two of them. Luckily, I do so much damage. I'm not worried about him. Sister Maggie is another familiar that will follow you around. Uh, all she does is shoot uh, tears. Uh, it just deals. Small amount of damage. It's nothing too big. Nice. Dark Matter increases my damage, but tears also have a chance to uh, fear enemies, which makes them run away from me. Brother Boobs, Brother Bobby, uh, is just like his, like Sister Maggie, just uh, just follows you around, familiar, follows you around, and uh, causes uh, a, a little bit of extra damage. Haha. -ha. Now, there's also a lot of times super secret rooms, uh, which are a lot of times typically off of the boss room. However, I don't see how it would have been able to do it there. Uh, but that was a room that doesn't have anything adjacent. So the secret room is in between two. Like, this could be the secret room. And it's if you look to the right, you can see my map. Uh, it would be adjacent to two different rooms. I don't think it is, but it could be. Don't appreciate it.
Now, one of the things I like about the Steam Sale, the Steam Sale is, like I said, 50% off, but there is a chance, not the biggest chance in the world, but there's always a chance that... Maybe. Aha. Uh, that you'll get something like Super Greed or something like that, and he'll drop another one. Now, if he drops another one, that's 100% off everything in the shop. He did not drop one. That's sad. Sorry, he dropped a ton of money. And that may unlock to be Cain. Excellent. I have so many keys that I'm really not worried about this. Oh, and some stuff. Now this is a pip room, and what this will do is it will uh, change anything on the floor. So if I don't pick up that money, do that, and it changed everything on the floor. Ugh. Remove some of my tears, which kind of sucks. So this will make weird tears. I don't typically like these. I'm gonna check here. This could be my super secret room. Oh. Uh, that has, yeah. I think that's every time I hit a poop, it'll explode or something like that. It's it's fine. It's not great. Oh, heck yeah. <laughs> These are often worth it because they will be filled with uh, items in a lot of situations. Ugh, like that one. That one is Bob's brain. I don't want that one. Uh, it's good sometimes, especially if you have an item like Pyromaniac, which makes you uh, immune to, to bomb damage. It is basically you throw that out at people and it will explode. Yeah. But if it's damn it, close to you, then you will take that damage. And I don't want to wait risk my devil deals or anything like that. This one, when you see poop, it will um, give you uh, flies or I think it's flies. I don't think it, it could be uh, it could be spiders, but I think it's flies that will give you, which is nice. So let's do item room first. Okay. Ooh. Okay. So this gave me. Typically, it's butter bean. This one's, I can't believe it's not Butter Bean. That's funny, that's the first one I get. So, this one, if you look at the top left, I have an, an item, and basically, if you just press it, it will use that item. Now, Butter Bean farts. That's, like, his thing. Uh, I can't believe it's not Butter Bean causes damage as well. It's, uh, like, that. Cards. Oh, that's an amazing card. This is also amazing. I'm gonna use this Joker. Joker. Get what I might want from here. Thank you. So you feed him hearts, and he will give you stuff. Those are...
You almost did. There we go. Okay, that's nice. We'll give me tiers up, which gets me to uh, eight, which is great, and uh, shot speed. Now this guy can give you things like money and things like that. He's trying to show you. I have no idea if his health. If he, he's very, he's completely random. If he's wrong, he'll give you, he'll throw a fly at you, and, and it could possibly hurt you. I have so much money, and we're at the end here that I'm just gonna pop these out. Click him a bunch of times now. And he blew himself up with that troll bomb that I was talking about. So I'm gonna grab that, I'm gonna blow that up too. Get money and keys, money and keys. Alright. Not gonna do that one yet. Ah! That was very nice. So this is we need to go deeper. This can find, uh, this can either take you down to another level and skip, or it can show you some uh, secret uh, rooms that are in the basement sometimes. Bomber Boy makes your bombs explode in like a plus pattern, like uh, the game uh, Super Bomber Man. Ow. Pentagram gives me extra damage, so you can see now that I'm at 11 damage, that that can take out most things with not really any problems. Nope. And there's my school bag. And I'm gonna go ahead and Pop that. Yeah. That was accidental, but that's alright. I'm just gonna pop this donation machine until it explodes. Boom. I like that one. Oh. Oh. I love it. So here's mom. I do so much damage that it wasn't a big deal. Okay. So I hope you guys enjoyed that video. That was just one. As we keep going, we're going to unlock more things. We're going to get past mom. Get into... Uh, the womb, deal with uh, mom's heart, stuff like that, and hopefully even go further from there. There's a lot of challenges I just unlocked. We'll do challenge runs at another time as well. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. I will see you guys in the next one. Later.